Hi everyone, Body here. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm here with a video response for um, Poet Spice, Jimmy Lula Tulula. She has a uh, make a card for my friend. She has a friend that had a baby girl. And um, you just have to make a card. The only requirements is that it doesn't have any pink, which is a challenge upon itself. So I wasn't quite sure which way to go. I mean, I love the channel. I'm not a card maker. That is not my thing, but I wanted to participate. And I said, I mean, how hard can it be? So it is hard, but I tried my best and I'll send her the two and she'll choose whichever one she wants. So the first one I made is a little five by five card. And I use some, I use a lot of greens in these two projects. And it's just a little card that I made very simple. I use this little um, picture is from the Secret Garden Collection from Graphic 45. My stamping needs help. It's New Baby. I stamped New Baby there. And this is also from the Sweet Sentiments Collection. The paper and I distressed the edges, inked it up, put it on the cardstock. And then I have these rolled ribbon roses that I had gotten at a local scrapbook store. And then I made this little banner that says it's a girl. I hand wrote it and I put a little flourish there and that little flourish I got from Mel. And then I have this little ribbon I got from Julie the Paper Bag Lady. <clears throat> made a little bow, put a little flower and some bling and I wanted to keep it simple. I don't want to do much to that. So that is my first card. I uh, still have to write my message on the inside and of course this felt but I can um stick it on so this is my first card I even tried to sign it there so that's my first card for the girl challenge from Poet Spice and I wasn't sure so I made another one and this one I used purple and green and I tried to make a banner and instead of using the regular um, triangular and the the little banners that everybody thinks is yeah I tried to use some circles because I just got a uh, circle punch from Hobby Lobby. I just got in some stuff and once again, I just this one I know for sure this is secret garden paper and I use a A2 size card and um, Distress the edges and ink them and then put the paper. I thought it went well with the green <clears throat> Then this is a KM company little sticker that I have put it in the center put some burlap ribbon cut the circle punches and then use some thickers um, and then in the corners, I just made a little ribbon with a little bow with some seam binding. Then there's the little Julie the Paper Bag Lady um, doily and acrylic flowers. And I'm not sure where I got those. And I did the same on the two sides of the banner here. And then it spells the word baby. And at the bottom, it has the word girl on other circles, which I also inked and edged. And then... I used these little doodad flowers that I got from Shabbylicious <clears throat> and once again thickers I used my circle punch and then at the bottom just to finish it off I got this from Alicia from Alicia Glitz and more so I used that little trim at the bottom there just to give it a little touch so this is the front of the card I'm going to write my message on the inside I didn't do much and on the back I just put a piece of the paper just so that it wouldn't be so blank. So anyways, Jamie, this is my video response. I will be surely putting these in the mail for you tomorrow. Here's the first one. Here's the second one. I guess you will choose which one you want to <coughs> give to your friend. I really hope she likes both of them. I'm sure, oh, of course, you can give her both of them. So anyways, and don't forget the, the, the Marty patty blog hub that jamie lola poet spice is sponsoring this coming weekend i hope to see you all there we have some special projects all of the girls so please make sure to visit each one of the girls and see the projects that we've been creating so anyway this is my video response jamie i hope you like them here's the little one and here's the bigger card y'all have a great night bye